especially if you don't like climbing 
much of the hair when you apply heat. You're like basically burning your hair. So now I've taken the top section down, given that spray. But as you can see, like this top section just does not remain straight. It's harder to be straight. It kind of does want to sit with a kink in it. And it does want to sit with a bit of frizz. But that's looking a little bit better. See what I mean? It's like a little bit more flattened down compared to the other side. So it's kind of the best thing to do. This side, because it's a little bit thicker in the top section, is a bit harder again. But we're getting there. We're almost done. We're almost done. Okay, there we are. Get that wee curl in. Just to flip these under. Okay, so then after that, I did put some makeup on and I got changed. And then I decided to make some protein cookies. So, <laughs> we're making these are really good protein cookies. They're only about 130 calories per cookie. Uh, so we're putting 110 grams of butter in there. Then we're going to pop quite a bit of sugar. I think it was like 130 grams of sugar. It was quite a lot. Let's we'll see what it says. Might not be as much as that. So it's like 110 grams of sugar. And then you cream that in with the butter. This was like flora, so it's like flora light. It's really local. And it's not proper butter either, but it works quite well. Protein brownies and cookies are quite hard to make because protein powder doesn't help with the consistency. So I'm always trying new protein powders. So we're popping in, um, this is meant to be 60 grams of plain flour. And then this is the protein that I use at the moment. I think it's calcium protein. Um, it's made from eggs and this is called Standard as the brand, which is my fave. And we're going to put 60 grams of that in as well. I put slightly over. I put 65. <laughs> And then I put a half a teaspoon of baking powder. 
so at 180 degrees or 350 Fahrenheit, you want to bake them for somewhere between 10 to 13 minutes. These ones were baked for about 13 minutes, because um, they took a little bit longer to, to kind of get that hard coat on the outside, so there we are. There is the cookies, all nicely baked, um, and then I just kind of put them onto a plate. I did do that you don't see here is I was making these in time for the Manchester United game. Here we are. So at this point, Rashford had just scored the goal, and then we had um, Granacho score a second, and it was 2 0 to Man United. Uh, the big black bit on my TV is from my camera filming it. I'm not sure why it's doing that, but it was. After the game, we decided to go to the cinema. Yay! So this is a retail park called the Glasgow Fort. It has loads of restaurants, loads of shops, and it also has a cinema. So the view is called. Um, so I got some popcorn and got a bit decided to get tickets to go and see I Want to Dance with Somebody, which is the Whitney Houston uh, movie. And I have to say, it was absolutely fantastic. So I got sweet and salt popcorn and a large Coke Zero. Popcorn was so good. But yeah, the movie was fabulous. After the movie, went to Wagamama's. Um, this is the menu. I love their menu. They do so many kind of vegetarian options. Uh, loads of choice for me. I'm pescatarian. And I like this. It's cherry blossom lemonade. It's non-alcoholic and it's so good. And I got the no duck Donburi and it is so nice. It was so nice. It uses like a sea tan. It's gold instead of duck. It was really, really, really good. Um, and then this was like these squid balls. And what hadn't arrived yet that did come was um, salmon gyozas. And they were so good. They got home and I said hello to my doggies. They were like, hey mom. Especially Lindy. She loves a little bit of a cuddle after you leave her in the house for a few hours. And then I got settled in, cozied up, because I was of course going to be watching the Super Bowl. Um, I love my sport. My Super Bowl team, or Super Bowl team, my NFL team is probably, um, would be Denver Broncos, but they've not been playing very well as of late, so they're not going to get in the Super Bowl. Uh, so it was the Chiefs beat the Eagles. I decided that I was going to support Philadelphia uh, Eagles for absolutely no reason. I just picked one. <laughs> I like that one. I'm like, woo. Um, and then I had my cup of tea and I got all cozy up on the couch and I had Hugo beside me. Now, this didn't start until 20 to midnight UK time. Um, and I thought it was an interesting choice for the national anthem, but it was different. So that was cool. Um, and yeah, it didn't finish until half past three in the morning, UK time. And did I watch it all? Yes, my friends, I did. I watched it all. <laughs> um, and I'm glad I did because it got very exciting uh, with the last minute uh, kick from the Chiefs to win. Um, so yeah. So that was my evening. Hugo was all snuggled in. And then at half past three in the morning, I decided to go to bed. I got my hot water bottle in there and got myself cozied up. I was knackered. I'm tired today. But thank you for watching.